Now, let's have a very good yes. morning, Tony Bellew. Uh, what a game last night. Wayne Rooney, what a hat trick, Tony. <laughs> morning, Tom. That's why, he always, that's why he always has to be on the pitch, boys. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, we said exactly. it earlier. We we'll said it he, earlier. If he's fit, mate, he has to be on the pitch. I don't care. What about that goal from his own half? Cracker, drilled up, ping. One of the most gifted players our country's ever seen. Probably the most gifted player since Paul Gascoigne, I would say. Yeah, English um, player, defo, defo. And uh, I think we'll only realise that when he does go. Yeah. Hey, hey Tony, bed, uh, uh, listen, uh, hopefully that's Everton on the way now with Big Sam. Tony, yeah. back to your sport. Uh, what do you make of that, uh, Eubank uh, Senior there, having a little pop at Tyson? Tyson having a little go back. He basically called him an apprentice. That, that's out of order, isn't it? Uh, I mean, he's got to think carefully when he speaks, which he, which he very, 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 very does, Mr. Eubank. So, uh, I don't know, mate. It, it, it's handbags. It's, it's a little bit of a six or one half a dozen of the other. So, I don't know. Tyson's Tyson. You know, he, what he's done, mate, is absolutely... He, he's achieved some phenomenal things. Yeah. Thank you very much. He's achieved some phenomenal things in his career. So, yeah. Uh, I just, I, th- I think he should be appreciated. Tyson Fury, I really do listen. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying everything he says is right all the, everything no. he says is right all the time. But no. uh, he has said some don't silly say, things. Don't, so. don't ever take away from his ring achievements. Just a sec, mate. <laughs> Sorry, go on, guys. I just <laughs> no, I said he, he hasn't helped himself, uh, Fury, with some of the things he said, and he's got a bit personal. Uh, but he did achieve yeah. something magnificent for yeah. you know for a man of his age, heavyweight champion of the world. He did, mate. He did, and uh, and I think the only thing left for him to do in his career is lose to me. Well, what so, is uh, what's the latest on that? I'm happy to do it, mate. I mean, everyone's saying I'm scared of fighting big every week, and I'm sick of hearing it now. So yeah. it's kind of annoyed me that much. So I thought, you know what? Let's just fight the biggest one then. Do you think is well, well? Hey, I don't know. Is that going to happen now, Tony? Uh, or would you rather say, okay, Tyson? Uh, you know, let's let's see. Let lose the weight, get the all clear, and let's have it. Lose the weight. I mean, listen, David's telling me he can be ready. Well, he's not telling me. He's telling Ed he can be ready. So I, I, I still believe that's the fight that a lot of the you know the British public want to see. Yeah, I'm sure you guys want to see yeah. it. I think it is a fluke to finish one. So uh, I'm happy to punch him all over the place again. <laughs> you know, it's, it's as simple as that. You know, I don't do uh, any... There's no chance in boxing. You, you don't fluke no. anything. You get in the boxing, you're prepared to fight. And what will be, will be. But yeah. he's injured. Uh, Tyson's got to lose weight, get his license. And yeah. so you're in limbo a little bit for a for fight. So, you know, you was all geared up for the Hay fight. Well, what's the latest on fighting again? Well, he just you? said he'd come back. Uh, David no, but Hayes when? Just... When, when? When are we going to see Tony in the ring? That's what I mean. We'll reschedule the date. Uh, I think Eddie, Eddie knows more than that. Looking at March or April. Right. Yeah, I just want to be back in the ring as soon as possible. But that's the most important thing to me. It looks yeah. like um, frustrating as well. Tony it looks like AJ yeah. and Parker could happen. We're waiting for an announcement there. I think that could happen. Uh, listen, mate, AJ's the, the best ever in the world, in my opinion. Uh, the most ruthless ever in the world. There's a difference with styles. Everyone says you know, you're saying you won't fight AJ, but you'll fight Tyson Fury. Styles make fights. AJ throws all twenty punches in the space of about three seconds. Every one of them is powerful, and he's very, very fast, mate. So, Ball accounts, uh, he's not been down, Parker, as an amateur or professional, or even sparring, mm-hmm. they tell us he's, he's not been down on his backside. Mate, that's nothing to brag about. It's not about how, how many times you go down, it's about how you get up and what you do when you do get up. So I wouldn't be bragging about that with him. If he fights Anthony Josh, you may believe you, mate, he's hitting the floor, and he's hitting the floor pretty quick. <laughs> <laughs> so so you, you probably enjoy Christmas, Tony, or will you be in training? Do you know what, mate? I'm I'm, uh, I'm another year older today, so... Oh, happy birthday, yeah. Happy birthday. Thanks, mate. St uh, Andrew's Day as well. It. I'm trying to deny it as well. I'm <laughs> saying <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm, I'm happy. Uh, you know, we've had the disaster of a year so far with my brother-in-law, so we're just trying to get through things day to day. Still, mate, it's still very hard, but it's... Uh, I'm doing all right. I, I just want to do what the one thing that keeps me sane, and I know this sounds mad, is when I'm punching people in the face, and that's the one thing that but I'm happy that I'm doing. So I need to do that a few more times, and then uh, we'll just see where it leads. Do you still, is he still train with uh, Ad Evan? Uh, uh, yeah, Leon trained with you a bit, didn't he? And a yeah, few of the boys. Trains, Aussie trains, Evo trains. Yeah. Stubbs, he's been part of the group for a while now. Uh, yeah, I mean, we uh, that, go that, that keeps you going as well, doesn't it? Motivated and that. Oh, it, the does, it does, yeah. it does, especially lads I've looked up to since I was a kid, they bow and Aussie and stuff like that. So then they've been my mates for many years now. Uh, yeah, I enjoy training. You know, I don't enjoy the 12 to 14 week slog of going and living basically in Rotherham, which isn't the most uh, 
nicest place in the world. I, 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 I think of better words to say, guys. Well, just <laughs> well on here. And what do you make of an ex uh, Red coming on the coaching staff? Eh, were we Sammy? Yeah, listen, I'm, I, people have gone on and gone nuts. I've known Sammy Lee quite a while, and let me tell you, Sammy Lee's a winner, and I don't care what it takes, who it takes. I want to see Everton winning again. You know, people have gone on outside to these days, Sammy Lee, this and that. And I said, listen, you have no idea. I remember Sammy Lee scoring. Sorry, not Sammy Lee scoring. I remember Southampton beating Liverpool at Anfield. And I remember Sammy Lee jumping everywhere. I remember Crystal Palace beating Liverpool at Anfield and Sammy Lee jumping everywhere. Sammy Lee is a winner. He's a professional. And, you know, yeah, Exactly, an ultimate professional. And, and um, I've never spoken to a footballer who hasn't told me Sammy Lee is a brilliant coach. Tony, oh, I'm happy with that. Tony, thanks for your time. Have a great Christmas, mate, and uh, let's hope you get your let's wish. Let's see you in the ring soon, later. yeah. Let's see you in the ring. Thank you very much. Well done, Tony. Tony. Listening to that, boys. Ta Tony Bellew there. There you go.